Hello, my name is Marjorie Young, and in today's video, we're going to talk about 10 different things that your local Rotary needs to know in order to get visibility. We have the most incredible story on the planet. We're probably the largest humanitarian club in the world with well over a million members. And we do good all across the world, but we also do a lot of really good work locally. In today's presentation, we're going to go through 10 different tips that will show you how to get visibility in the local newspapers, which then end up online. So why is this visibility such a huge initiative this year with Rotary International and locally with our district 6920? Because the better visibility we have about all of our great works that we do in the community, the better likelihood that we will get more members to join our cause. Okay, so before I start talking about the 10 different ways to get visibility, I want you to look at this slide and today we're going to concentrate on the middle one, how to get publicity. Publicity is a, a free way to get information into the local media, which then ends up online. Um, up in the upper left hand corner you get you have advertising of course that is a a paid spot that goes in the newspaper or on television um, and that we're also going to be talking about the PSAs the public service announcement in the lower right hand corner so I just wanted to make sure we had that distinction first before I before we started on the 10 tips so tip number one is create a year-long PR plan for your Rotary Club, for your local Rotary Club. Think about all the good news that comes out of Rotary. It might be that you have a new president every July. That's going to happen. And you have a new board. That's, that would be news. That would be something that would go on to this year-long PR plan. Think about all the service projects that that all of our Rotary Clubs do every year. Um, the media would like to know about that. Um, that's a press release. Think about all the times that you donate money to an organization. That's a press release. All that kind of information needs to go onto this grid, onto this yearly PR plan. People are also submitting press releases on every time there's a new member. That is a possibility for it ending up into the local newspaper. So there is so much good news that your local club has that the media would be very interested in, that something could go out every month. But if we could get at least four press releases a year that go out, that would really move the needle with visibility about all of our good works in the community. Okay, so my next tip is on how to create a visibility team within your club. Getting publicity out to the media and then getting it online takes some work. And it's too much work for, for the already very busy president to take on. So our tip is to form what we call a visibility team. Somebody in the club watching this who likes to write press releases or likes to write, somebody who likes to take pictures, somebody who likes to take videos could form a visibility team. And it might even be a good way to engage the new members of the club to get involved and be on this visibility team. So now that you have a visibility team, the team is going to create a media list. And a media list has all the major newspapers, television stations, radio stations that they can get the information to in hopes of it getting picked up in the local media. Okay, so next tip. Go down and actually meet the media. Let them know all of our good news that's going to be happening throughout the year. That way it will get your information on their radar and it will mean we'll have a better chance of getting our good news picked up in the local media. So when you're meeting with the media also let them know that you have access to already produce public service announcements. And these public service announcements can be downloaded from rotary.org. And they already have produced television 
PSAs, radio PSAs, newspaper PSAs, and billboards, but it's going to take a visibility team member to go down there and let them know that this stuff is available. So now that you have your plan done, you've reached out to the media, you have a great list, now it's time to go back to your plan and say, okay, what month is it? It is July. And on our list, it says announce the new president and board. So you're going to do that by creating, writing a press release. And it can be very simple as who, what, where, when, why, and how. That way it's all on one sheet of paper, less than 400 words, and it is what the media uses to get all their facts straight. It's much easier for them to receive what we call a press release or a media advisory um, than to call them up and say, hey, by the way, we have a new president. It's just a lot less room for error by giving them um, a press release. I also want to suggest, along with the full page press release, also create what we call a social media post that you can then copy and paste and put on to your social media sites. I really love what I'm seeing in District 6920. I see a lot of people posting to Facebook and all the, the social media sites, but I really want to encourage you to take it a step further and let the local media know about it. A lot of our members are already following you on Facebook. If this wonderful news gets out into the, the mainstream media, there's a lot of people who are not members of Rotary and it will give them an opportunity to learn more about it. So there's a lot of different ways to increase our visibility in the community and online using traditional media and using social media. One of the latest tips is also using live stream. Last year, Facebook came out with Facebook Live and it's so easy. You can go right from your cell phone. You, you open up your Facebook page and you hit publish and you might record the speaker live or you might record um, somebody in your club once a week just to learn a little bit more about that person. There's so many ways to, to be creative and, and tell our good news. Okay, before I share tip number 10, I want to encourage all of you to like Facebook page District 6920 and share your good visibility hits when you, when you do get into the newspaper and when you do um, get on television. Put, post those links up there for us so you, we can share it with the, with the entire district. So there are so many other tips and pieces of advice on what we could give you to increase your visibility in the community and online. Um, but one of the most important ones is to wear your pin. This creates more conversations wherever you go. I was on an airplane one time flying coach and I met somebody who was a huge Rotary supporter. There was an extra seat in first class and they asked me to come up and sit with them up front. And I said, yes, proud to be a Rotarian and proud to volunteer on this special project. Thank you.